three, two, one. Hi, this is Sinitra Bowdry, and we're with Quiet on the Set magazine. I have with me Vincent Kirkwood, Hello. who has a brand, a shoe brand, and a shoe company, and he's going to tell us more about it. It is in the Detroit, Michigan area. So welcome, Vincent. Thank you. Thank you for having me, Sinitra. You're welcome. So tell us a little bit more about what your shoe company does, who you are. Sure, sure. Um, as, as you mentioned, Vincent Kirkwood, um, the name of our company is called Pink Pump, and I'm the co-owner. Nice with my wife, Kelly Kirkwood. Okay. Um, and we reside in West Bloomfield, Michigan, and the store is in uh, Bloomfield Hills, Michigan, which is a suburb just north of Detroit. Mm -hmm. um, and we bought the brand Pink Pump about uh, a year and a half ago. Wow. Uh, we bought it from its previous owner and founder, and um, we saw an opportunity that mm -hmm. we kind of acted upon at the time um, to buy the brand. My wife was actually an assistant principal in education, wow. and I was a corporate guy in marketing. And uh, the opportunity presented itself, and um, that's how we came across the company, and that's how we made the purchase. Are there a, is there a target audience that you're looking at right now? Or sure, sure. Them? So, you know, Pink Pump is in the Bloomfield Hills area, and if you know anything about the metro Detroit area, yeah. Bloomfield Hills is kind of a posh mm -hmm. area. Um, we have a certain clientele in that area, mm -hmm. um, and they want what they want. They don't want... Um, what they don't. <laughs> yes. They want what they want. Yeah. And um, so, however, we have an online as well. Uh -huh. um, and just to go back a little bit, we actually started Pink Pump online. Okay. It was online for about six months and right. it did pretty well. And from nice. there, we were able to take it and create this brick and mortar location in Bloomfield Hills. So, um, we're, our clientele is a little sparse. We have a lot of the, the neighborhood uh, women in there. Mm -hmm. um, but we like to think of, of Pink Pump as a location for all generations. I like that. For, you know, the young woman, yes. the working woman, uh -huh. the mother. And even the grandmother. Absolutely. Got shoes for um, <coughs> babies, uh -huh. infants. Right. All but, um, yeah. So share with us your online, what's your online site? It's www. Sure, yeah, yeah absolutely. It's www.pinkpump.com. Okay. And Um, when, when, when we had her, we were looking at different shoes for her, like uh -huh. the Melissa's and, and, and okay. the different shoes that um, are available for babies, and we love the Doc Martin brand nice. for her. So we picked up Doc Martin's as one of our, our key, um, key vendors, because uh -huh. in our area we've got a lot of high schools as well, and the, the young high school girls like the Doc Martin shoe. Um, it's a comfortable shoe, um, you know, very, very comfortable. Get, you get a lot of wear out of yes, them. Yes. They last a long time. Can, yeah. yeah, so, you know, so we've got the edgy Doc nice. Martins for the edgy babies as well as the adults. Edgy. Yeah, <laughs> and then, you know, when you go up a little bit more, we've got uh, Lamb, we've okay. got Steve Madden, okay. we've got Cape Robin, we've got Sam Edelman, okay. uh, or is it Sam Edelman? Uh, we've got Potato, uh, potato. Yeah, exactly. <laughs> potato, potato. Uh, we've got J Slides. Okay. Um, yes. Of, of brands that we offer at Pink Pump. That's nice. I really like that you have several brands. Different styles, different ages, yeah. and even a different target. Social responsibility, like what's happening with what's going on with black men and black Absolutely. women right now. Situation mm -hmm. now, or can you help us, or do you know any ways that how the shoe fit in with this situation now? Absolutely, that's a great question, and and what what the the world, especially the African American community, is going through right now is very important. Yes, and as a as a business owner, we want um, to be a part of the change that we that we want to see mm -hmm. in the world. Mm -hmm. um, and Pink Pump is very uh, socially responsible when it comes to that because one, uh, my wife is. showing yes. some of the young women and young men that there are other African-American entrepreneurs between me, myself, and my wife. 
and she also is, um, she goes back and in, in Anything else that I haven't asked you that you'd like to share with us? Thank you. I appreciate it. Um, no, just you know, just building the excitement around the brand. Um, okay. You know, as an entrepreneur, uh, it's, it's it's a tough task. And as we move into our one year anniversary of actually having our brick and mortar, mm -hmm. we're very excited about it. We're excited about the future of the brand mm -hmm. um, and some of the things that we've been able to accomplish over this first ten months. And we're, we're looking forward to the next 10 years, for sure. Vincent, before we leave, tell them the name of the brick and mortar as well. Sure. So Pink Punk is located at 2527 West Maple Road in Bloomfield Hills, Michigan. And you, we can also find us online at pinkpunk.com. And you can follow us on Instagram, Pink Punk, as well as Facebook and Twitter under Pink Punk as well. So you have it. Pink Pump is an amazing shoe store that's not only something that you can wear for your soul, your feet, it is also doing great things.